This is the installation video for the Rig Ready model PRBS 3000. When you are installing the main plate to the carriage of the fork truck, you need to find the center line of the carriage. After you find the center line of the carriage, measure from the center line to the outside of the carriage 6 inches when installing a class 2 or class 3 main plate or 7 inches from the center line when installing a class 4 main plate. Physically mark this spot on the carriage. This will make alignment easier when you are on the fork truck lining up the correct location for the main plate to be installed on the carriage. As you drive the truck forward, make sure the forks go into the two large tubes on the stand. Driving forward, let the carriage just touch the main plate. After the carriage on the fork truck engages with the main plate, lift up the carriage until the top of the carriage engages under the lip of the main plate. Lift the carriage up about a quarter inch after the carriage is under the main plate lip, then tilt the carriage back towards the fork truck. This will align the main plate against the set screw in the alignment bar on the back of the boom. At this point, the operator can pull the hairpin on the red handle main pin and remove the red handle main pin. After the red handle main pin is out, lower the carriage on the fork truck down until the main plate is lower than the alignment bar on the back of the boom. Check to make sure that the main plate is setting on the carriage of the fork truck correctly and in the right location. Back the fork truck back far enough so that the forks are entirely out of the tubes on the stand. Raise the carriage up approximately 4 feet. This will make it easier to attach the bottom backer plate to the bottom of the main plate. After the carriage is raised up, remove the bottom backer plate from the storage bar that is located on the top surface of the stand by removing the two 1 inch grade 8 bolts. Make sure the high side of the bottom backer plate is away from the installer and facing up. This will match the bottom profile of the carriage and ensure a correct connection of the bottom backer plate to the carriage. Attach the bottom backer plate to the bottom of the main plate using the two 1 inch grade 8 bolts provided. Now the rig ready boom is ready to attach the main plate to the boom and take the boom off the stand. At this point you can either take off the forks or you can connect the boom onto the main plate that is mounted to the carriage with the forks on. We design the tubes in the stand so that they are large enough to allow the hookup and disconnect of the boom with the fork still attached to the fork truck. Dry the fork truck forward, making sure the forks go into the tubes on the stand. When the main plate is close enough to the boom, tilt the carriage slightly forward. Lift the carriage up until the main plate is into the alignment bar. Tilt the carriage back towards the fork truck and the main plate will rest against the set screw that is in the alignment bar. The red handle main pin will be lined up and both the red handle main pin and hairpin can be installed. Remove the black handle pin and hairpin that holds the boom onto the stand. The boom is now ready to lift out of the stand. Lift up the carriage about 3 inches to release the tabs out of the holder and the boom is out of the stand and ready to rig. Total time to do this entire connection should take less than 5 minutes. At this point, the operator can move the large lifting hook that is provided with the system to the various locations on the underside of the horizontal boom to suit the particular rigging situation at hand. Rig ready. Ready to work when you are.